So we're in the Bet Angel ladder interface here, and uh, you can see a lot of information contained within the ladder interface. But what we're looking at this is this particular column here. If you have um, Show Full Market Depth ticked, it will switch this column on. If you don't, it will just show nothing. And the idea of full market depth is it shows you all of the money that's been traded at certain prices. So you can see on the favorite here, it's traded as high as 4.1. There's 300 pounds traded there. And it's traded as low as 305, and there's virtually no money been traded there. So these figures here represent the amount of money that's been traded at that particular price. And you can also see two colors. So a good way of understanding information without looking at the numbers is to visualize it, and that's what we've done on Bet Angel. Is you can actually visualize uh, how much money's been traded and where. So we can tell that most of the money's been traded at 335. Um, but the yellow color that you see here, which is what we've got here, the traded volume bar color, this is for the whole time that the market's been opened. So we're saying since the market's been opened, a lot, you know, this 8, thousand pounds been traded at 335. Minutes. Five minutes. But we also have. Um, changes in traded volume as well. So you can see here we've got a time frame of 60 seconds. So over the last 60 seconds this color represents what um, has been traded over that particular period. So you can see here over the life of the market all of this money has been traded here but you can see at the moment there's tons and tons and tons and tons and tons of money being traded at 3 and 305. Um, if I just move uh, the settings, I'll close the settings for a moment away, you can see if we look at the second favorite you can see Money's been traded at a number of different prices, but most of it's being traded around this level at the moment. So being able to see these colors here will give you a visual clue as to where money is. So you can see at the moment it's blocked out at 3 and 3.05. It's hardly moving from that particular area. And you can see in the last 60 seconds it's touched 3.10, but it's mainly been traded at these levels. Also, you can see as a proportion of the total amount traded, you can see there's a significant amount at 3.05 been traded in proportion to the total. Now you can start to see the price moving up from there. So can you see how when you look at the full traded uh, depth you can tell where all of the money's been traded but also using this delta the last 60 seconds or so you can see that in fact this represents um, a good clue as to where current price activity is. So we saw it go down here as a proportion of total money traded the amount increased quite dramatically and then uh, that stopped it from going down any further and then the price started to move up so you can see as the price is moving up obviously there's been less money traded as a proportion of total at this level so um, using this column you can get an idea of where the market's traded and you can also look at where it's traded for the entirety of the, uh, the length of time that the market's been opened and also over a specific time frames and that is uh, the full market depth column